It's a big money maker come winter time, but the weather is not cooperating just yet. We wondered if that could mean the opening date for Sandia ski area will be pushed back. News 13's Catherine Zone took a trip to Sandia to find out what it will take for an on-time December 20th opening. She joins us live from the Newsplex. Good morning, Catherine. Good morning, Crystal. Now, many ski areas around the state are already getting into the swing of the season, while Sandia is waiting for that perfect temperature to start making snow. They say they've spent the last couple of months prepping their snow cats and snow makers, but before they can flip the switch, they say it has to be at least 29 degrees or colder, and not just for a few minutes or even a few hours. Managers at the ski area say they need 29 degree temps for at least six hours or more. Now that's in order to justify starting up the guns and bringing in the staff. So what happens if it doesn't get cold enough for long enough in time for opening day? Managers say they'll cross that bridge when they come to it. Because of our limited snowmaking water that we have, if the weather isn't on our side, we'll just have to postpone until Mother Nature helps out. But we're really hoping that Mother Nature will come through. And so do we. Now there are a lot of few loose, a few loose ends to tie up, whether there's snow or not, like staffing. Crystal, back to you. All right, thanks for the information, Catherine. Kuhn says they're holding a job fair this week in the 13th and 14th. For more information, head to our website, krqb.com, later on today.